I wrote this poem here by myself. Sometimes I tend to enshrine myself. I look in the mirror and see me. I am so glad I am me. I will write my poetry of me. You know, that it's all about me. You know, the one that I see in the mirror is created by me. Well, don't even look in the sea. There is no chemistry. It's my statue that's important. I realize I'm okay. I am so busy becoming who I am, it's a beautiful mess of me, and that's okay. I am developing my talents, you know that? I know what they are because I love them, which is me, of course. And I practice them all, all the time. I am so proud of myself. My peacock feathers are spread out all the time. And my greatest gift, however, is being altruistic. <laughs> I have a genuine concern for others. Just in case you don't know what altruistic is. What a joy it is to help others all the time. What a pleasure it is. I try to follow the laws of nature, and when I think of how wonderful I am, it sends shivers down and up my spine. I don't need drugs to make me feel good. I am high just to know that God loves me. All I do is for Him, who has provided me with the eternal quest, the grail of life, the fountain of youth. And when you love yourself, you have total freedom. My life is like I am always in the right place, always doing the next right thing. I am under the wing of my angel, living where I am is like being an ocean, humongous, feeling like I am going everywhere all the time, full of stimulation and undercurrents, stuff full of life. It's so great to be me. I love myself so much. I could bust like a balloon and reach the moon like the cow did. Wow, isn't living great? I just love living my life. I thank God every day for not being for for not being a superstar. Just an ordinary guy living in the world. And maybe that's why my wife thinks that I am the greatest living person of this century. We both know it. Thank God no one else does. <laughs>